What's up guys, it's our coach Armando from Colossus Fitness. I'm here, I'm gonna show you guys how to use the machine seated preacher curl. So a lot of gyms might have this and if you have it, you should probably utilize it. This will train your biceps in the shortened position. So how to even set this thing up? This guy has a whole stack of weights. So you're basically just gonna select whichever weight you want to. You can usually adjust the seat here. It has different levels. So find what works best for you. You're gonna sit, you're gonna bring your chest right up to the pad, arms right here. You're gonna find a solid grip and you're just gonna execute. So you're trying to squeeze all the way to the top, slow on the way down. Don't let your arms lock out, keep the tension. Just bring it right back. Usually on something like this, go anywhere between 10, 15 reps and you should get a good pump going. But yeah, that's exactly how we utilize this. All right guys, so three common mistakes you'll usually see done on this machine is going to be, number one, hyperextending the elbows. So, usually when you start off with this machine, I like to keep my arms bent, pull it in, and then from there, I can find my elbow position, so that way I'm not putting any extra pressure. So at the end of every rep, you wanna make sure you open, but keep the tension, and then you would close all the way back up. So that way you avoid any unnecessary pain in your elbows. So number two would just be half repping it. So a lot of the times, because people think, you know, I'm using a machine, this is gonna give me all the support I need, so I don't really need to keep my form clean. And that is not what we want. We actually want you to utilize the support you have, but make sure every single rep is quality. So, all the way to the top, as close as you can flex your elbow to get a full contraction on your bicep, and down, as I said, don't hyperextend, but just keep some tension there. So none of these little half reps, it's not doing you any good in the long run. So, number three, top mistake that we see done on this machine is going to be slouching over this pad. So this pad is here to support your chest and make sure that you have good posture when you exercise. When things get heavy, we don't want to feel like we're slouching over in order to just do this because it feels way easier when you have all the support. So once you actually have your grip, I want you to bring your elbow in line with this little hinge right here because that's where the machine moves. Pull your shoulder blades back, have a nice posture and that way you are just using your biceps in order to move this weight versus using a bunch of extra muscles to support that. So that way you're not cheating your reps and you're keeping it honest. All right guys, that's all for now. So smash that like button and if you wanna see more of what I'm doing with the other coaches here at Colossus Fitness, click the first link in the bio and check out our website.